What's up, everybody? Hello, and welcome back to more Vicky 3 as the United States. It's 1889. Um, we've gotten out of a, a lot of little wars here for Africa. And we still need to establish some of colonies in some of these regions. So let's go ahead and just colonize everything here. I think that'd be okay. Um, yeah, we're about to finish the colonies over here. There's some little small ones. Do we have a free interest? Available? I do. Let's get one in Persia and Arabia. We're just kind of... We're working to really control the Southern Hemisphere, I've realized. We haven't gone much north. I guess that's because all of Europe's already claimed. Um, and I don't care to deal with Russia. And we do have a good relationship with China anyway. So yeah, we're doing we're doing very, very well. Second rate GDP, we uh, need to lower our iron, coal, and steel demands to do the main goal of economic dominance. But I don't know if we'll hit the GDP that we need for that. Uh, American Congo is requesting we permit them control of their own market. Uh, no. It's a terrible idea. Austria doing a thing like that. Do we want to be... I kind of hate the alliance with GP. It's not getting us any value. I'm going to break the alliance. I like, I like GP, but they're not doing anything with us for the alliance. I'd rather get an alliance with somebody else. Um, and Austria's an option. So let's go and accept that treaty. Let's just see, because they're, they're a tough uh, SOB, those guys. Like, Brazil immediately wants the alliance. I think they broke their other... We have, no, we're happy with our treaty with you, Brazil. I'd rather get it with China, honestly. Honestly. Hold off. We have 20 infamy. I want to get that tick to, to tick down, and then I want to attack Japan over here to make them protectorate for 50 infamy. I think that would be good. Mexico is in dominion status. If you look at our power block, we've gotten everything done with the power block. It's fully built out, but we can keep inviting countries to it, like Costa Rica over here. So Costa Rica, if I wanted to invite you, if I owe you an obligation, 10% chance here. Let's improve with you to try to get that number up. Do you already like us? Why is your chance so low here? So if I look at power block, invite Costa Rica. What are the reasons? You are cautious. They're economically independent from us. So I can fix that. This trick is we just export to them. And then we import some of their other stuff. Import some of this stuff. We do terrible trades from them. And then suddenly, we won't be economically independent from them. Well, what do you know? 47% chance. They declined, unfortunately. Well, we'll keep the, the shitty trade routes available over there. Um, drop the ones that don't make money with other people. And we just chill. Let's look at our institutions here. I need more, a little bit more, and I can go and do the last level colonial affairs. That's a good call out for me. Uh, I want to get, let's get South China in our list of things we care about. Colonies, let's get the Zambia and Congo. We're about to block out most of the people from the, the um, west coast of uh, Africa. There is Great Britain to worry about, but we're going to get a lot of this stuff before they even have a shot here. Places like Herrera Lera Land. And British East Africa is actually colonizing too. So, a lot of control we're going to have. And, what was I doing? I'm just doing something. Let's unpause and think about it. I do need to do a restart, I think, at some point to... Um, Oh, there's a lot of... Oh, yeah, I forgot we have guys trapped. Where's the army that has... Okay, here's what we need to do. We need to start bringing some of these small guys in here. This 10th army can just come over here. Let's get the 9th army as well. 9th army's empty. Okay, disband that army. 6th army has some... Okay, you actually have some units in you. Oh, you're the ones that are going to be based in Indonesia. This is going to be our East Indies garrison. East Indies garrison. Fifth Army has some irregulars. They're all conscripts, though. However, we will send you to the Army of Florida. Or we'll just disband this stuff. This one should go to the Army of Florida. You actually have real troops. Get on over there. 
Seventh Army, you have a commander. This was part of the Army of Observation, I believe. Take that as a yes. And this army as well, we're going to give you to the regulars. That uh, eighth army. So that should be everybody. You're all going to be moving to consolidate, and you're stationed at Dixie, this fourth army. Uh, we'll call this just the rebel suppression. Rebel suppression. And let's go and mobilize you and assign you to this front that we've just spawned. All right, real quick, I'm going to reload my save. That way I can get rid of the, that glitch with the naval invasion thing, so I'll be right back. All right, we are back. We're now with the fixed UI. It's actually showing me that I have some isolated states I should actually improve on. wonder how long these guys have been isolated, and I just haven't known about it. Um, we have low org for a lot of stuff. Most of these guys, did you maintain your orders? You did maintain your orders. Good. Most of them are living in a lot of states. I can't directly fix that, which is a problem. A lot of isolated colonies. Most of those will fix themselves once they're done. Um, I think I can offer a lot of things here. It offer guarantee independence. I can call ally, offer obligations. Interesting stuff. How are we doing as far as our building? We uh, we do have more room to construct stuff. So personally, I need to have some glass and steel. I think built in our own buildings here. Ooh, my game. Is my game going to crash? Okay, no, we're good. Let's do a broad. Let's look at uh, places like Jalisco here. That's a good option in Mexico. Let's do some more. And you have terrible Veracruz. Ooh. Do 10 in Veracruz. But Paul is our... Where's Bhopal? That feels like part of the um, different market. Rio Grande. Let's, let's sort by peasants here. Central India. A lot of things in not my market. Mexico's got to fix their problems. I'm going to queue up some in Mexico, and then I'm going to go and do a... Uh, Railroad in Mexico. Sort by infrastructure here. Who's got terrible infrastructure? We'll do this anywhere that is in my nation. I want to make sure all my guys are doing all right. We'll pay for their stuff. North Bengal. This is all British. Los Altos is ours. Welcome, Beak. You know, here's the thing. is Normally they subsidize this. So if I actually... Let's just test this with Lowlands. If I build these, will they subsidize it and I get the profits from paying for their problems? Could be a curious thing. Let's promote the guy to Major General. He can have it. Low armies. Navy Yard Gosford has lost their generals. They both just decided to uh, retire at the same time. There we go. 120 exactly. It should all be fine. There is a war. Airland's gone. War over. A lot of gold rush in America. Very uh, profitable time to be in the States. Point three behind. We are now the number one GDP. We just crossed it, and there's a uprising that's going to contest us here. So we are, how are we doing on prestige? We are quite far from being the second in or the first in prestige. Uh, let's go ahead and just keep using this rebel suppression army to deal with these small uprisings. How are we doing in colonization? Everything's being colonized. Okay. So where do we go soon? So Senegal is independent. Normally to me that's a sign that Senegal should be part of my market. I can invite Chile into the market. I'll owe you an obligation to guarantee you're in. Welcome Chile. Keep expanding into South America. This is going great for us. Very, very good here. Both feels depleted. That's unfortunate. Still is improving our relations. Maybe I should get rid of the vassalization stuff for the internal... Um, in, like the internal defense stuff. I could drop like uh, one of those taxes. Problem is those taxes, the services and opium taxes are 
very profitable, to say the least. It's it'd be crazy to just kind of kick them off now. Let's go vacuum packaging for everybody. Am I taking stuff directly, which is causing me to have to redo all this stuff? What's going on? Wait, can you actually? You can't do automobiles yet. Okay. Uh, fertilizers for all of these. We'll leave them to be their default stuff. Leave those the way they are. Uh, fertilizers for the millet farm, slaughterhouses, increased wool gathering, and barbed wire fences. Can this engine pump? Always. Automatic irrigation for the plantations. Same for the cotton. Same for dyes. This is an interesting micro. You could spend a lot of time microing all these uh, these things. Here's, so if I we have some power plants, not in our own nation though. I don't know if we're ever going to get electric power because I'm not the one investing in it. We'll see though. How much are we paying for subsidies? Not a ton for our railways actually. Interesting is that when you don't actually invest. Do I need any railways in my own country? I should probably check that, right? I do. I need a couple. We are allowed to build railways. Got to remind myself that it's on the list of things I can build. Speaking of, I also need to build myself some more um, government administrations. Thought I was done with these. Tax in California. Let's just move these all up to the top of the queue. Bam, 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 bam. Carbon administration's out the wazoo. Fix all our innovativeness problems. Let me go to the last tier of colonization. I threw a railway up to the top two. That's fine. Uh, that'll fix those problems. Glass expensive. People have no goods. Uh, what are our like staple goods looking like? Oh, well, that'd be why. We have very little in the way of grain and paper and shit, so... That's why things are expensive. Gold speed in California. The forge. What's our private construction doing right now? Railways in West Virginia. Railway in Ulster. Explosives in Ohio. Iron mines in Delhi. Textiles in Pennsylvania. Oil rigs. A lot of them. Our investment pool is still actually growing. We're actually outpacing our investment pool even with 700 construction. Which is actually really good here. They want a point of bureaucrats. Uh, we must understand that we're not doing that. Uh, we do not need the can opener. Lucian Leroy. He's a pacifist, sure. Yeah, fuck the French. All my homies hate the French. What are we getting here? We get a lot from Mexico as our dominion. 20k. Quite good. Yeah, colonization is the way to earn funds in this game. It's it's good to start as a strong nation and actually have the opportunity to colonize. Uh, we need to do more of these. Let's go somewhere we have peasants. Let's fill out Nebraska. Sounds like a good opportunity to just get Nebraska kitted out. This is going to cause us a lot of problems. Uh, a lot of financial woes. We're about to get a 50% a bump in our, our number of construction sectors. So, considering we were spending, what, 40k? 400k? That's about going to be a 200k swing in uh, expenses, assuming we can actually afford to buy all that stuff, which is a big question. What's our... Uh, what's, oh, I'm, I shouldn't do this with Costa Rica. Costa Rica close. They are close. Keep improving with Costa Rica. Keep improving over here. Oh, City of Plenty. They can celebrate... Establish alliance, sure. What do you know? I want the alliance again. Thanks, friend. Maybe now you'll actually honor it a little bit. Looks like Paraguay is going to be in the league soon. And there we go, having... Okay, we now have more than enough to do our colonial affairs. Organization is good. 
Do you have any unpaid taxes? Only 9k on unrealized taxes. Where's that last healthcare stuff come from? I'm not sure. How's production spending? We're getting uh, this stuff soon. Do you have any society spreading? Are we... Oh, we are actually... Multiple alliance and less infamy generation. Oh, this actually is a huge tech now they added the infamy generation. That's that's crazy good to have. Uh, well, let's just hit up a lot of these ones that are going to be interesting to me. Government dividends efficiency. Sure, that sounds cool. Arcades. This is just giving us flat prestige. Well, actually, authority's cool to have. Film. We'll just get the whole tier. Screw it. I don't care. Don't need to be super, like, exact with that now that we're going to... Like, the military stuff you need to have just so you can hold your own late game. Um, but this should give us enough. The stuff down here we can get eventually. None of these late t like tier production stuff really matters. I mean, arc welding could be helpful if you really want to build a ton and get, like, capital ships and things. But, you know, none of this really matters. Radio is the only one in here that you kind of need. Radio and telephone. So we'll kind of... Let's throw those in the queue. And likewise, the combustion engine could be nice, but other than that, everything else here is kind of optional, in my opinion. Almost at a thousand. I want to. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna build one more construction sector just so I can get the being at a thousand. Just to see it, it does give you ten construction from the throughput. This might be exactly a thousand. Not sure. Nine 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 still. That that counts. That's that's good enough for me. Being one off is not terrible here. Oh, what are these? What would you offer me? You would offer me obligations, somatic packs. You would offer me other garbage. This is Mahra. Nothing interesting, really. Don't want to fight against uh, those guys. So this is the uprising here. We have American Congo getting involved with us. We'll send the... What is this army supposed to do? You need, you're in Niger. Go and... Uh, get there with the East Indies garrison. You can't reach, apparently. Rebel expression, go do your job. Knock out one of those guys. Norwegians are coming to America. Surely I should be able to go and do, like, multiculturalism here. What's... So actually, let's try cultural exclusion. It's the last tech we really need. Everything else is good enough. For our purposes. Um, workers' rights is on the list there, but no one wants that. But if we can get racial segregation, we're, we're looking really good. New mandate available. New country to be invited. Oh, you will accept. Welcome, Costa Rica, to the power block. That means Paraguay is getting closer and closer. I can stop actually doing... Let's make sure I'm not doing anything with any of these guys. I want to make sure I'm not lobbying where I don't need to lobby. Honduras. Okay, cool. Guatemala. All this is fine. All that is fine. We want to make sure we are lobbying here. Let's do a trade agreement with you, just so you feel involved. And likewise, it's also improved with Paraguay. Yeah, doing a lot of stuff to try to get our power block expanded. Colonization rights again. Let's make sure we're still doing Namak land in South Africa. Adventures break blanks. Get custodianship. One for odds here. Uh, this is Argentina versus you. Argentina, what do you want to give me? you give me protectorate status of Argentina? You would, but I don't need to do that. Not necessary. None of these are good either. Sandsbar, I see this one. Oh, but thumbs up would have been really good for them. Uh, what do you want to give me? You would give me a bankroll. This is... Who are you against? You're against Tidore, the Philippines, and a bunch of other people. 
No one really massive in this list, though. Just the... Oh, the British Raj is fighting you. Huh. Interesting. Well... I don't really want to take infamy for this. I think I'm fine letting that tick out. If they offered me a state, it would be different. Like if I had a transfer state option, it would be much different here. We'll let that tick out. They might call us in as an ally. I hope not. Right, if I just declare neutrality, I won't get called in. There's the smart move there. We're in a kingdom sided with Zanzibar. Sounds like a no. Portugal sided with Zanzibar. Surely you would give me something crazy now. I should probably not be improving relations with you. Oh, you're improving relations with me, I see. So you've got France, Great Britain, and China, and Russia. All willing to get involved in what I will be doing. I'm going to try to take over Japan. It's on my list. I want to do it. It'd be cool. Um, so why not do it, you know? New targets to expand the market to. In order to trade routes, our import routes and stuff are losing us funds. That's all good. Let's look at our own market here. We need more furniture. Let's build some furniture. Abroad. This is the problem with building this stuff. Start by profit here. Bajo. We have 10 of those. We also still have a huge demand for paper because I keep building fucking paper mills. Zooland is our nation. Let's start by peasants here. Or, or earnings. I, or, um, I need a good number of peasants to actually want to build this stuff. India Munsters on that list. Gyeongju, Gujarat, Arissa, Mexico's on there. We'll just put a lot in Mexico and then I'll build a, a fucking um, power plant in Mexico. There you go, not power plant, a railroad. Fix that one way or the other. Our great nation. It'll just take some momentum. I don't, I'm tired of these election events. I wish I could just like have it do its own thing. I don't need to micro anymore. Our nation's been capped out over here. Well, we do have some angry folks. I guess we could throw out the uh, Constitutional Party. What the hell is this dude look like? I thought he had like a Plague Doctor mask on. I was freaking out here. I guess if we do this, we'll wait till the election. We'll do, we'll do one little swap at the end of the election. No reason to worry too much here. Yep, we're now solidly in first for GDP, and now it's just about expanding. Uh, expand our colony in South Africa. Stationed in Niger HQ. Go ahead and get all the way over there. So you can't reach the East Indies, huh? Are you trapped? Shouldn't be. Colonies are going. Empty pockets. Old age pension gets okay. Oh, that's the other. That's one thing we could go for. We don't have any uh, old age pension laws like welfare laws. Production and agitation. Much to the Whig Party. Sure, become ambitious. What are we working on right now? Right now we're doing railways. All right, let's see what these do in Egypt. Let's see how those cost us. Subsidizing trade centers. What is expensive here? Oh, we're funding lobbies in New Granada. That's fine. 
Uh, no clue affair, sure. Dark Satanic Mills. Lose some stuff there. Lose some influence. Ah, New Granada. Are you coming into our 93% chance? Good. I can stop guaranteeing your penance and stop lobbying against you. Sounds good. Lists. I should grant a lot of these guys access to build into my... Oh, well, no. I want my, my private instruction to build in my nation. Doesn't make sense to do otherwise. So let's go and um, do a funding lobby in Paraguay over here. Let's start working on Nicaragua, too. And Guatemala. We have a duty to end slavery. Yes. Our power block is strong. We've got most of North America. A little foothold over here. I think South America will fall under us eventually. I need to just work with Group Bolivia. Uh, let's start guaranteeing your independence. It's gonna be it's gonna be a hard task to get them done. I might actually do a mutual investment agreement with them, like we had in Brazil earlier. It's up to 15 million GDP. Yeah. 150 million. So how are we doing with GDP uh, prestige compared to them? Most of theirs comes from Navy. Our Navy's probably up there in strength too. Yeah, we have a comparable. They have a uh, 500 flotillas. We have 240. So I guess we have more quality than them. I think that'd be a fair assessment. Sure, we'll do a trade agreement with Peru, Bolivia. Uh, mutual foreign investment. There you go. And we will fund your lobbies. And just like that, we will be uh, expanding their market. So then we build in their market benefits us. So let's go ahead and like, you know, build some tooling industries. Let's actually work on China. Let's get our let's get our GDP up real quick. We've been focusing internally, but I want to just really crank the uh, GDP. So let's get some steel mills in China. Or some actually, what are what our opium look like? Looks like Mali has a lot of options for opium production. I probably should import some of these, right? Let's import from. Uh, See by productivity. The British market for paper. The f uh, I like the French here. I want to do some of these too. Is there an Anglo Indian revolt? Is that what I saw? Anglo Indian aristocratic revolt. That's not going to exist very soon. Synthetic plants are getting built. Territory of Hawaii. Seven of me. We can annex them. Like they did that, the man being a puppet. Welcome to Hawaii. We will reduce your subject payment. And how you will exempt your service. Eventually, we're going to annex them. But it's not a, a big thing we have to do here. Uh, what is this play against France? What if I transfer states here? Damn, I could have gotten the like some stuff from them. Oh well, we will join just for the uh, ally option. So what what is France like one out of this? Just war reparations, and that's easy to get. I guess we actually have a front against France. Let me actually can I um. Transfer these away? I cannot. Okay, well, let's uh, just raise some conscripts for some reasons. Let's get some Florida over, get the regular army raised, and we'll get rebel suppression raised. Rebel suppression's gonna be. Let's get this one too. It's 
probably a front over here as well. There are multiple fronts over here. I want to see what goals they add to this. You want to humiliate us. You back down? Coward. We would have won that. What's this one? This is Portugal against the Brunei Uprising. Nothing valuable here. Crucial states. Yeah, nothing valuable at all. All this is fine. I need to build more stuff. Let's go... What's the British market needs? You need a bunch of fucking motors. So let's go and build some motor industries for you. Go by population. North Bengal. Build 50 of those. And in North Bengal, we were also going to probably build uh, two of these railways. Let's just double check that we're not paying for our um, the railways. Where do we make those? Make sure everything is good here. There's a lot of stuff going on. We did steam engines, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we won't go to steel pasture car. We can't go to sawmill because we don't have power. Nor electric street light. Vineyards are on automatic. Good. Can't do electric fences. Could do. We don't want to spend oil on this, I don't think. Yeah, we'll stay one level above, below oil. Machine tools could be good. Do we have enough rubber? I don't think we do. We'll hold off. We'll, we don't need to use our rubber for that. And then we have elastics now, which uses rubber. Don't need the rubber. What did I want to do? I wanted to look at my railroads and see if I'm profitable. Like here in the Midlands, right? Yeah, subsidized cost zero a week. So we build them infrastructure and we and they pay for it. Sounds like a good idea, because when they when they subsidize it, we'll get the dividends back, so we'll always be making money because they'll pay for our, our expenses. At least I think that's how it works. We will see. All right, Social Security. Um, I didn't ever change my uh, government after the election happened, did I? Yeah. We do have a lot of loyalists, though. What's our pop looking like? We're the number four in pop. Wow, we've, we've been growing. Let's go, U.S. Spread the word about our gold in California. Uh, people from Brit Britain are coming? Or, or Breton? Um, we don't really care about the Yeoman. Dies agriculture reformer. Did you ever pass the cultural exclusion? We did. Is there anything left to do? I guess it's Social Security. Old age pension is the only thing I can think about. Well, let's throw it out there. And then eventually workers' rights. Once that comes around, and we'll have done everything. And there's still fucking 40 years left in the game. It's just now we're just in the expansion phase, really. Just a lot of expansion and building up our economy. Nothing really uh, too wild here. We do have a lot of uh, unrest or... Uh, their living problems, and I can't really do anything about that because I can't give these guys jobs, which is really interesting uh, place that I would just have to kind of deal with it. Domestically, I can fix our infrastructure problems, though. Anywhere with single-digit infrastructure, I want to build more of. And I will pay for those. Uh, that does not matter. This is uh, someone else. And this is just in the T-Bay or whatever. Uh, Rebel Suppression, come over there and deal with them. 
Double check we have no colonies to grow. That sounds good. We're going to grow all these really fast and we'll give them to other people. Because we should be out speeding these guys. No progress because we can't grow there. Yeah. So why can't I not be in this region? I guess it's because it's the American Congo, technically. And we're doing these ones. I guess. Why can't we just keep accruing mandates, even though we are full up on our, our stuff here? So I do all power blocks. We're, we're in a quite a good spot, I think. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do 10% increase there. Hawaii, how do you feel about me? You are still a puppet. How many uh, of these do I have? Okay, I think I have 50 of these yet. Or am I like 49? I'm not sure. But I did do Newfoundland. Actually, I can tell you how many states I fucking have. It's easy to check that. Let's look over here. Mission to Africa, sure. Let's see. States. 52 states is what we have. How many uh, of these are not integrated? Most of the, the, the small ones. So there you go. Um, we'll go back to our default here. Could make them into a puppet here. What's the difference? If I make you a puppet, you get involved in my wars. Do you have enough men to make me want to get you involved in my wars? We'll keep you a Dominion for now. Don't need everyone to be a puppet here. Timler's out to other subjects. Not coming to my wars. Yeah. Stay become a puppet. You're pretty stable, so I'm not concerned about what's going on with Mexico. Uh, not We haven't have been having unrest problems with you. You will be paying me a good amount of money. 27k. And it doesn't take too much to have that. Rubber rush. Uh, yeah, horse rubber stuff is good. What's our power block look like right now? Still looking for Uruguay. Peru Oblivia is increasing pretty fast because we're actually like helping each other. What is this one? This is Hawaii. Alright, sounds like my signal to annex them. Can't even defend yourself. I guess you can defend yourself, but you just have a uh, nothing there. Really, you become my subject here. Against Mysore? Just the ally? Sure. Let's raise one army here just to defend our home front here. Make sure we're okay. Let's also get the Rebel Suppression Army to come and deal with uh, what's going on up here. Two armies should be enough, I think. So we're involved in a couple of these. Costa Rica... This one's the one I want to make sure it doesn't involve me. A lot of increased autonomies. And independences. And over here, it's just the Hawaii one. Which should be fine. Okay, that's all good. Building up our stuff for Peru, Bolivia. There's some stuff going on in Costa Rica. Oh, is Costa Rica going to join our power block? Yeah, Costa Rica will join our oh, brilliant buckets of ducats. Now it's going to be Nicaragua who's there. That's great. There we go. We almost have all of Central America under our thumb. Also, be building stuff. Remember to build stuff, Sean. Mainly with the motor industries. Abroad. By earnings.
I know none of these are actually my nation. Build a lot in Jalisco, and then we're going to go and build a fucking uh, railway in Jalisco, too. I think Jalisco is right here. Okay. Media endorsements. Uh, bonus and atmosphere chance. Sounds good. Let's get that old age pension done. South Germans are migrating to us. Hawaii has been annexed. Or radical Hawaii, I should say. We're doing all right then. Slavery and colonial later. We will get rid of the hypocrisy. Tape. So now we have Costa Rica, right? Our subject. Cool. Minus 22 for Costa Rica. So power block wise, one nation here. These guys are all along the way here. We guarantee your independence. You'll probably come along soon. And then we're just looking at Argentina and the other small guys. Good, 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 good. This is actually really great. Ron's gone. We don't care what's going on elsewhere. No one's going to get involved with us. Okay, I think it's getting time to attack uh, the Japanese Shogun. I bring them into the fold. There goes Hyderabad. There goes Paraguay. Paraguay, come and join us. 5% chance. Why? Economically independent? Okay, we can fix that. Uh, import. 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 Import everything you produce, and we will export things that you don't produce. I'm messing this up. Uh, import this. Import this. Export this. Okay. Let that adjust, and then eventually you will be uh, perfectly fine to join us. See, now it's 28%. That'll change every time we make some time. We're also just interested in us, huh? How does this work with this one? Not except for 41 reasons. Okay. The laws are progressing. Oman's in default. Bonifers are being built. Now they don't value the obligation at all, which is interesting. Volume of trade, economically independent. So if their, if their attitude changed, this would go up, it seems. And right now, I feel like we're almost there with our attitude. Sway against France and they would bankroll us. Let's look at this battle before we do that. If you want bankroll to cut France down to size. I'll take a bankroll. Come from New England. Come over here and deal. So my game is going a little bit slow. Driving to Togo, Timbuktu. Where are you? You both are going there. Okay. Let's go and raise the Army of Florida. And the Army of Observation. A lot of small little guys over here. Oh, it's because... Reg oh, I don't even see this. Fucking Spain's getting involved in this? This is, even, this is a completely different war, and I, didn't even, I almost got uh, ganked by this stuff. We 
Where are these guys? Station in the Midwest. Uh, I need you to join. To go join the East Indies garrison, please. Where are our navies, by the way? You're in Dixie. Gulf of Guinea. Go over to the West Coast so you can defend the any crazy shit from Canada. There goes Revolutionary Senegal. Got a lot of fronts here. There's Old Age Pension. We'll pay for that. Go ahead and kick that up a little high. Five days here. British Raj into Shalmer. War with France. Uh, you're at Dixie. Let's make sure I get everything right. At Liberia, one more coast front. Two guys in Dixie. Do a Army of Florida. Come and just do an invasion here. I think it with the guy in Dixie. Should be fine. Um, I need you to come over to this front, too. We're going to lose this. I'm going to lose Senegal. This is a big buyer for me. I didn't realize Spain was over here. Well, let's see. Hoping not. Spain. Here's what we're going to do. Go and just land over here, please. Frontline shenanigans are really killing me here. Make sure you're... Yeah, that's fine. Just stay where you're at. We're gonna come and just deal with Spain. And there should be a, an open front here. Where is this army going? I'm going to just put more generals in charge so we can do faster fights. Where did our navy go? When, when you come over here? Um, God, this is just a clusterfuck of people. to this front instead. All right, someone got pulled back here. East Indies Garrison, raise you. I'll deal with this shit, please.
don't really want anything to do with any of this shit. They wouldn't humiliate me, I don't care. This invasion is progressing. We actually are going to take that stuff. Okay, my subject gets to stay, thank god. Okay. Got out of the big war we didn't care about. What is this stuff? They want to cut France down to size. Okay, um, let's just do that then. Or try to do that then. How are we gonna... What are the interests that the Regency has over here? L. What's the best way to land in France? Let's have landed Flanders. The one in Iberia. Will cause some problems. Come out of all these colonies. We're making a ton of money here because of, uh, oh, because we're not building any fucking thing. I need explosives. Sort by... I wish I could just look at certain places. Where is the highest? Just do me by... Um... Well, the jump down here is kind of insane. You go from... Okay, these two. Will kit me out with explosives. A lot of these are being caused because our need from artillery, so it's temporary cost. Um, defend this front, please, gentlemen. What you did was brave. Um, but I would like it if we did not station to Dixie at some front. I want you the one in Dixie here. Rebel suppression. Do me a little sneak attack here on the other side. And with a guy in English Channel. Uh, Great Britain lost. I don't know how that works. We now protector it. Well, we're occupying a lot of stuff here. See, this is the interesting thing about Africa is that the time it takes my army to come over here, they're going to push back this front if they're smart, and it would just be a ping-pong of my army. Wars in this part of Africa just are terrible. Absolutely terrible. And yeah, we're just going to cause some problems by having a lot of fleets spread out here. Uh, let's take this army here. Let's do a naval invasion over in Provence. I'm going to lose most of these. But it's not about winning. It's about occupying time. Which we are very capable of doing. And causing France to have some problems. And we're being paid for all of our time here, which is even double, doubly as good. We have, what can I even do with the mandates? Right? Like, what is what is the point? Uh, Paraguay would accept. I can, it means I can stop doing that. Peru Bolivia would accept. And then Senegal... We have enough leverage to invite Senegal. They don't like us. We'll get Senegal on our, our block here. Uh, which also means I can stop doing the guarantee independence and other stuff from Peru, Bolivia. One of your lobbies. Peru, Bolivia, Paraguay. And Senegal. They're antagonistic and they're economically independent of us. Cut off the unvaluable trade routes. The American market is strong. This is actually a lot of fun, just expanding it this way. Uh, let's start working on the remaining guys in South America here. Let's also do some lobbies.
Let's make sure I'm not doing anything else. I also don't need to have mutual investment with you. Mutual investment with Great Britain, puppets, trade agreements. It's a pact with Brazil. Good relationship with Argentina, Senegal, Uruguay. Protectorate, proof relations with Nicaragua and Guatemala. Oh, I see. I am actually at the limit. It's kind of annoying. But oh well. Alright, we want to finish this war off. How is this invasion doing? It's not going to progress. Ooh, who's all being offensive here? Go and defend. We'll just hold the front here and occupy people. How is their, uh, their debt? 8k loans. Austria has 67 loans. Austria's gonna go into default before they do. Probably because they're paying for our bankroll. In fact, that's a definitely because they're paying for our bankroll kind of thing. Good news is we're opening a second front, or at least we're trying to. Let's just keep this alive. We've beaten down their manpower. So where things are actually going quite well. They have only 60k there. We have about half that, so we are outnumbered. But it's the attack from multiple fronts that's going to win the day here. And I think they start to collapse if we open up the second front here. Especially with us actually um, killing off so much manpower from them. See, Cindy's garrison. You're at the front over here. Yeah, we've picked them all out of the uh, this stuff. Can we colonize anything? I need to make sure I'm doing that. Especially with Portugal now getting getting involved. We want to block off our competitors. Great Britain, I think, probably has malaria now, or like malaria prevention. Judging by how fast they're colonizing. Uh, go and defend. We don't want you at the Flanders front. Did we lose battle? How was... Oh, Sherman's having some problems. We are advancing, though. Large armies fighting here. Getting more losses. We're getting sea lane strats. We're getting better navies. We're getting the spread for sea lane strats. We are also doing it at the same time. Go ahead and drop this. Go to destroyers. That way we can get things at the right level here. Oh, and I forgot. I needed to do... Well, this is going to be mostly finished. We already got Multinational Alliance, which is good. I also was meant to be doing some annexations of Japan, right? That was on my list. So let's uh, start that demand there. I think we'll put a cut in here. Um, this war is still ongoing. It's, it's, it's just a matter of time. We also... We have no reason to be in this anymore. So it's just kind of like a pride thing at this point. Also, that reminds me, I need to build more government administration. Where do we have low tax? Like domestically. Anywhere we have low tax gets at least five of these. Probably not necessary to build that many, but we're doing it. And I think we can uh, call this one here for now. This war is ongoing. We're getting some push going. I should have maybe landed. Well, I guess I need to land over there because it's a different region. We'll see how we can do against Japan. I think uh, our naval advantage will probably win the day here. So let's see how that goes. Uh, but for now, I'm Carl Sooner. I hope you enjoyed. I've been Sean, the Spoo Screeners. And as always, I'll catch you next one. Later.